right here, Tony? Uh, I meant you, you had a uh, chance to get into your own tape by now. Who, who or what uh, sort of stood out from their first week against Ryan? Well, the quarterback uh, definitely stands out. He's got a strong arm. You know, you saw how many points they put up. He overthrew two or three other touchdowns, like guys wide open, and uh, just overthrew them by, you know, a couple feet. So uh, I think, you know, you always see a big difference from week one to week two. I think they'll probably correct that, and, and uh, he'll be a lot more. His timing will be better. The receivers will run under the, under the ball. Uh, so I think, like, he's the first one that stands out. Um, they have a couple of receivers that are really fast guys, a, a returner as well, um, who can really, they can, they can go from point A to point B and change to put points on the board in no time. Um, so you know, just watching those guys. And of course, they run a different offense, the go-go offense. So like, you know, just, just being, uh, having great eye discipline for us has been the biggest focus in, uh, in allowing our, our guys up front to do their job and, and not allowing them to uh, create the big shots and plays that they want. Um, but really, their quarterback has kind of really stood out to me and the receivers and, um, you know, and the running backs. The running backs are really good, too. On the left, Andrew? With, with just the one game of tape and new coaching staff and a, and a lot of transfers over there, are you, you going back to tape from some of those coaches' previous stops? Do you do, you do that at all? Or? No. Next question. No, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just uh, You know, of course, I think uh, anywhere, like, I think people look at stuff I've done at Kentucky, stuff Jesse's done in the league or at Vandy, like, I think you always try to figure out what the coach is kind of like his vibe is. What you know, it may not be the exact players, right? And it may some of the plays might be a little different, but how is it? So when you watch me call a game, or when I call things at Cincinnati, or I'm calling a scrimmage or something here, like I'm coming after you. Like they, everybody already knows that. Like we go against the offense, they already know. Hey, in the spring game, I knew you were blitzing on that play. Well, that's me. That's my personality, you know. And so you try to figure out, you know, when he's going to throw shots or when he's going to run the ball, when something crazy may show up. So you kind of try to watch film, um, you know, on, on the on the opponents, you know, on the coaches from previous stops if you can. The one thing about that, just like going into the first game, is you don't want to chase ghosts. You know, you start doing a lot of, covering a lot of things and you don't cover anything. So we want to be focused on what our fundamentals are and really we want to stop the run, have good eye discipline. Uh, when the ball's in the air, take the ball away, destroy all the blocks, have great effort and angles and communicate. So as long as we focus on those four things for us, we think we'll be okay.